So previously we spoke about ER diagrams. Now we'll talk about enhanced ER diagrams. For our purposes, I'm only going to expect you to use the ER diagrams and I'm not going to expect you to draw something that looks like this, but I do expect you to understand the concept of it. So here, this is the concept of specialization, generalization, um, or participation constraint and disjoint constraint. So here we have the table staff. We're all familiar with the table staff. And you can have this subclass that is optional. So may, while everyone has to, all staff members are in the staff, some of them might be managers, some of them might be sales personnel, some of them might be secretaries, or they could be a combination of manager and sales personnel. So the optional means it's optional. They don't have to be in one of these subcategories. Some people can just be regular employees in a different part, you know, so they don't have to be in all of these. It's optional, um, but they could be, and they, in fact, and it means they could be in more than one. In this case, you have another subclass, which is saying it's mandatory. You must be in one of these two. So you mu you can't be, or there's no way you could be in both. You can't be full-time and you can't be part-time together. That's impossible. So it's mandatory to be in here. And in fact, you must be in one or the other. You can't be in both. So that, this is um, concept of subclasses. Later, we'll see, well, how do you know how many tables this should be? And that's something we're not there yet. We're going to discuss that at a later point in this semester. But right now in our ER diagram, if you if you were discussing enhanced ER diagrams, this is what we're referring to. Um, we still we can see our branch has staff and the relationship. We can see um, branch man, manager. We can see a lot of our relationships that we spoke about. But the interesting thing is this concept of subclasses where some people in staff might be managers and some will be my secretaries and here it's optional to be part of this and you could be part of um, more than one which is the and and here with the or it's either or and it's mandatory you must be in one or the other subclass 